Hello, Joy. Hello, and welcome to How the you think it's channel. going with the boss? Why does he have to be on all this list? Today, I'm gonna comment on my dog's Look, behavior. He's so angry. That's one angry cat. Mm. So, therefore, we will go back on YouTube and see the video again. And if some people choose not to do this kind of training, then then it will just play out anyway behind your back. Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. What I'm showing you is a first time walk. It's the biggest male who uh, they always need to be challenged uh, to not bully the sisters and brothers. I use my dog as a trainer to give the cat as many learning possibilities as possible. And now the dog comes to me around the cat, go back and check up on the rest of the tribe. My dog is making it very clear that she is not a threat by running all the way to the other side of the road. She's play ball, balling, she's like bending down, the, the tail is up. The cat doesn't understand what that means at all. The cat's tail is down. And the tail will eventually come up later when the cat see that its mom is coming. Look how the dog is running in between the mom and the cat just to play. Right? Not totally vlogging, but anyway, making life a little bit hard, keeping a nice distance. Now the tail is coming up. The kitten just decides to walk to the mom. And I love the way Team Fluffy Muffy just stopped. Herself. She's not hunting or chasing or anything, she just stands. And there. actually, I have made part two, the second video. And you can trust me when I say, Murphy, don't play around with the cats just by herself. She only do it because I tell Which her. Which makes me believe that this is actually the second time my big male, Mr. Beast Cat, have been challenged by my dog. Okay, Murphy, get the cat. Get the cat. She just lay down in position and say, okay, come on, come on. The cat sinks lower and lower down. Now the tail was up, now the tail is down. The ear goes down and Muffy is like, come on, come on. Muffy's tail is perfect, the distance is perfect. And the cat still have a little bit shakti and the tail is still a, not, not afraid. But now the tail is flat down and the dog starts to lose interest because she see that she reads the border and it's scratching. Head moves away. Another way to show no aggression and show how you're chilling is this yoga uh, thing. But also to look away. Now I'm gonna tell the dog to be happy. That will result that the tail will be wagging. And now the cat is comfortable enough to play with the dog. The dog now gets scared. The dog thinks that the way they're gonna play and interact is that the dog have to run after the cat. But the cat is actually ready for wrestling. The hair is not up, the tail is not thick, it's just nice training. Thank you so much for watching and have a wonderful day. Thank you.